God damn it, now my voice goes out? <laughs> Got it, great. Ho, 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 you crazy sons of bitches. That's right, it's that time of year again to bust out the stupid fucking hat, the ridiculous sweater, family drama bullshit, spending my hard earned money on other fucking people. Get the f out of here. It's the holidays. Welcome to another episode of Man vs. Dan. I haven't pulled this series out in a while, but I, but I ran across way too much sh recently uh, that I just wanted to cook the sh out of. I hope you're ready. This is going to be quite a wild episode. I hope you got your condoms. And by condoms, I mean finger condoms. Of course. Gotta slip one of these bad boys on here. Protect the old mitter, mitter finger. Oh, and we're nice and secure. All right, let's move on. If you are new around here, you know that there are three courses. The first being the alcoholic appetizer. This stupid f***ing hat isn't the only thing I bought on the internet this year. I got a Santa flask. Check this f***ing thing out. <laughs> Fill her up. First cocktail of the evening is gonna be an eggnog margarita. Ever heard of it? Look it up. Doesn't exist. That's because we make our own goddamn rules around here. You're watching internet history unfold right before your eyes. Now for this, you're gonna need some eggnog. It's seasonal. If you're watching this video in June, you're f***ing Next, grab yourself some tequila. Of course, the expensive kind that's in a caterpillar. I'm not necessarily sure the recipe, but I'm just gonna use most. Yeah, uh, maybe all the tequila. It is the holidays. You're gonna need something to f***ing get you through. Grab your eggnog over here. Yeah, yeah really, yeah, however much you want. Oh, give me that fucking nog. All of it! You just shake that up, and once you give that a good little f***ing holiday shake, now you just pour it out into a margarita glass. You know, really, if you put anything into a margarita glass, it just it makes it a margarita. Well, I don't know if I showed you this little feature. It's got a little spigot. Oh, before we pour, we gotta get a little rim job action going. Because I'm a fancy son of a bitch, I'm making a fancy f***ing rim. For this, I'm using some sugar. Little f***ing pinch of cinnamon on there. Nutmeg it. Nut all over this fucking rim job. <laughs> Monetize. Give your margarita glass a good little. Get a little what? Get some saliva on it. Yeah. <coughs> and then just get it in there, huh? Tipsy bartender shit right here. And then you just spigot it in. Boom. Oh, get out of fucking dodge. Oh, stop, stop, stop. There we have it. Happy holidays. Let's give it this a little. Oh, that's great! Mm. Oh, all right! Woo! Mm. Happy holidays! Oh god, that tastes like shit! I'm glad I made an entire stocking full of this drink. <clears throat> Moving on to the next. Mm. Mm. All right, well now. All right, well now. Jesus Christ, losing my voice like a fucking eight-year-old over here. Moving on to the second course, the edible internet entree. Tell me this doesn't roll off of the tongue. Meat cookies. Say it with me cookies, right? Who the f wouldn't want a meat cookie? First thing you gotta do is grab yourself some holiday uh, cookie cutters, gingerbread men, trees, stars, all the bullshit. To make these, uh, very simple, you're gonna need some ground meat, pork, beef, sausage, duck, child, I don't give a shit. Now you take the meat and you want to roll it out. You know, before you do this, you may want to wash your hands. Sometimes a good idea. I'm pretty sure that I did. Throw that down in the middle, and then you kind of push it down by hand. And once you kind of got it at the point where you just don't want to touch it anymore, you put another piece of the parchment paper over it. Boom. And I'm just going to flatten it out even more. That's about like a cookie width. Uh, we got to go and put this in the freezer for an hour. I'll tell you what. I ain't nobody got time for that. Yeah, buddy. We're about ready for the second course. Mm. Ah, that didn't get any better. While that takes its good old time doing whatever it needs to do, we're gonna grab some sugar cookie dough. Oh, did you think I was making it from scratch? Just get into that however you see fit. That's a mess already. A little bit of this, and you just need it. I don't know if you need to do this. <laughs> Put a little on there. You do a little bit of this. You do a little bit of that. 
pretty easy. A little too easy, if you ask me. Is that a quarter of an inch? I don't, I don't fucking know. I'm not a goddamn human measuring stick. I'm going in with a Christmas tree. Boom, that feels good. Following that up with a little gingerbread man. A stocking. Yeah. Well, look at that guy, huh? I'm actually gonna take this star and I'm gonna manipulate it a little bit to try to make a Krampus cookie. I don't know if you know who Krampus is, but he's the goddamn devil. It doesn't get much more evil than the devil of Christmas himself. We're gonna get these all hot and bothered in the oven, 325, 12 to 14 minutes. Like you give a sh you're making these. Who the f do you think you are coming all up in here? All right, let's take a look at them. Oh, what the f are those? Why the f did they get so big? Even with pre-made dough, I'm f***ing this up. The frosting, the decorations, that's what's gonna bring it all together. All right, well, I'm gonna let these cool. Uh, in the meantime, the meat is ready. Pulling out the hard meat. Here we go. I think we're about ready. Oh, my neighbors. God bless them. Merry Christmas. And now we just take our little meat cutters here. We're gonna make ourselves a little meat man. Oh, God. Yeah, that's tough. Okay. That's coming out. All right. This is some meat magic. You gotta be kidding me. Look at this. Some meat mysteries. And then, oh, here's the winner right here. The meat man bread ginger man bread meat. I mean, come on. You ready for this? Actually, I'm not ready for this at all. Santa needs a flask. Oh, yeah. I got a cramp in my hand. Ah, I got a cramp in my hand. I can't move it. <sighs> okay. All right. You may want to try a little bit of... No, you probably... You don't. Trust me. Mm, that's something special. All right, moving on. Here, you're coming with me. Come on. All right. Yeah. Get this going. Ho, 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 and a bottle of rum. What? I don't know. I'm just excited. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, oh shit. Burning down the fing house with this sausage. Okay. Christ. All right, you ready to flip? Oh, shit. A little burn. I don't think you know how and hard this is with one hand. This is a YouTube talent right here. A little burnt over here, but you know, that's why there's two sides. You get two chances. That's so smoky in here. Meat cookies. Oh, wait till you taste them. Wait till you taste my meat cookie. Whoa! <laughs> Oh, folks, and she's out. You gotta see this in the light over here. Check those out. They look pretty good. They turned out better than the cookies. That's for goddamn sure. You could also dress these up. Watch this. We got some leftover sh in my refrigerator from Thanksgiving. I got some like salsa. Oh yeah, maybe this cheese. I think you got the picture here. Are you looking at these? That's meat. It's a meat cookie. Cookies out of meat. Holiday effigies shaped, formed, cooked, and decorated. Don't eat that. Let's eat. This is the one right here I'm going for first. Oh, ooh, whoa. Let me tell you how this f your brain a little bit. You're kind of going in thinking that it's a cookie, but instead you get like a savory, salty pork. That's ridiculous. Mm, this guy right here. You know that this one's pretty good. Mm, oh, God, you know, here, just imagine you're eating a cookie. Taste it, taste it. Take some of that, right? Complete and utter mind. We did it. This calls for a celebration. Cheers. Oh, God, that's still sh Moving on to the third and final course, the dastardly dessert. The sugar cookies are cool. Uh, you're pretty cool as well. <laughs> Let's get to decorating these. The icing, I hope, will take these uh, to the next level. I bought $84 worth of icing. Unnecessary, absolutely unnecessary. You know, a lot of times when people ask me what I do for a living, I don't tell them. <laughs> what do I even fucking Begin to tell them. I make vulgar cookies. I'm a f***ing asshole. Is that an acceptable answer? Now I'm decorating these going by graffiti principle, which is you put your solid color down first and then you outline it with your outline color. So that's the only way I learned <laughs> the f***ing color. On the streets! I guess we're learning how not to decorate cookies this holiday season. Oh my God, these are taking so long. I gotta get through these things. This is a mess. All right, these are done. Let me give you a little tour. We got uh, an angry Rudolph here. He is just, he's pissed. Every year he's gotta be in the front. There's insects and birds and shit 
flying into. He doesn't like that. This is another good one. If you're just looking to like just cut things off and never hear from that person again, that's Krampus right there. Check that out. That was a uh, an old star. Dug real deep into my ninth grade psyche for this goth Christmas tree. Here's this ugly sweater, which we turned a little demonic. A Christmas tree on fire. Used the uh, GFY cookie cutters this year that were in the Threadbanger box a couple years back. Obviously still coming in handy. Oh, ah! Then you take this cookie and you just kind of put it, you know, towards the bottom of the box. They'll, they'll find it eventually. This uh, cookie cutter turned into that, which I'm actually pretty excited about. I'm gonna taste one. Mmm. Mmm. Hey, awesome. Eating sugar cookies at uh, 1.54 in the morning. Those taste like shit. Where's that flask? Mm. Well, my friends, that is all the magic I got for you this evening. If you got any future episode ideas for this show or others, please leave them below. While you're down there, we're selling the merch. 10% off. Uh, there's discount codes and t-shirts and all sorts of sh** down there. You'd probably look damn sexy in a Threadbanger t-shirt. That's all I'm saying. And here's the other thing. If you're not subscribed, I suggest that you just f Get on the train. Because we're all riding it wherever it's going. <laughs> I don't know where it's going. And plenty more holiday bullshit to come. Uh, you won't want to miss it. I'll see you around here next time. Oh, and you know what? Thanks for watching this episode. I don't know if I, if I ever said that. It was super cool of you to do. Uh, if you want to watch another one, you can check out this. This is a personal favorite. This is from last week, Man vs. Vacation. Lord knows we need some of that. And then there's this little uh, subscribe button right there. Uh, be sure you hit that. It's up to you. You know, otherwise, that's it. This video is officially, it's officially ended. See ya.